All right, so in today's video, we have got the brand spanking new Galaxy S24 Ultras. I'm going to replace our Galaxy S20. Galaxy's have been a great phone. I remember back when the uh, Captivates and some of the first phones came out years ago. Uh, Galaxies have always been a great product and great phone. This one has been. In fact, you can see how I've taken care of mine. I've actually kept the original plastic on there, the wraps all the way around it. But as time's gotten on, you know, these things did have a great camera and great light source. But there is nothing like this brand new S24. And today we're going to go through the unboxing of the product. We'll go through a little bit about what we found already and what we've discovered. And let you know that this video is actually being shot right now using my brand new Galaxy S24 Ultra. So stick around, uh, stay tuned, and we'll show you guys a little bit more. All right, so, yeah, just as I've come to figure, got it well packaged in here. Wow. Tough to pull that thing out for a minute. <laughs> it's kind of really in there. Okay, there it goes. All right. Yeah, so right off the bat, I can already tell. I'll move these things out of here. You can see the size difference. This is the Galaxy, the S20. And there's the brand new Galaxy S24 Ultra. Been a great phone, like I said. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to uh, go through this phone. I'll tell you what we've discovered already about it. Again, I'm shooting on the actually 24 right now. Um, so I'll just go ahead and tell you guys, if you're getting the phone from your carrier like AT&T, it will carry a brand new SIM card inside. You want to make sure that when you open your box and look inside, there'll be a couple important things. I'm going to show you that right now. Um, one is going to be the SIM card removal tool. If you've never used one of these, I'll show you. A lot of you would take this thing and just kind of toss it to the side. I will say you don't really see it unless you look. There's like a little silver piece right here. If you flip it over and you look inside, it's just right there. I'll show you. I'll take this one out. Bear with me just a moment. There it is. Okay, so there's your SIM card removal tool. You're going to need to make sure you locate this and put it off to the side, and I'll explain to you why. When you get a new SIM card, I would highly recommend when you get the new phone, it's going to have a brand new SIM in it. You want to use that brand new SIM card. Now, the reason being is a lot of you may have an older 4G, 5G SIM card uh, or the older style SIMs. These are actually the newer style and they work a lot better. So you definitely want to put the new uh, SIM card in. Now, to do, the, uh, to do this, I'm going to hold my hand over this. Uh, you see this little pit? This is all you're going to use. When you're going to pop that off, you're going to take that. You're going to look at the very bottom of your phone right here you see this and you're going to take this and you're just going to lightly press down to open up your sim card tray you see that there it is that's where you're going to take this out put your smart chip in you're going to close it back down and then save that in case you ever need it in case you know something would go wrong but maybe you're going to do another phone in the family uh, down the line keep that and save it somewhere all right, so we've got a new SIM card. Now, we've already opened up two of these. And uh, as again, I'm using mine to record on right now. I'm going to go ahead and tell you right now, it does not, I repeat, does not carry a um, charger for this that you're going to be readily able to use. Unless maybe you got one of the Samsung Galaxy watches like we have. And the reason being is, if you'll notice, look at the ends. USB-C and C, you see the ends? not USB to charger. So see that? Hold it up there. Hopefully you can see it well. So right off the bat, you're not going to have a charger block for this thing that will uh, function unless you bought one or unless you have the, the smaller connection like that. Most of you are going to have the USB connection. So do make sure you know you're going to have to go out and get yourself a uh, universal or the rapid charge uh, from your dealership or maybe want to go ahead and order one so that you'll have it because right now we we do actually have our watches uh the samsung galaxy watch that does have the the actual same charger that you can use both usb or the usb-c uh, style block on and uh, there you go so i do have the protective cover on here i'm gonna leave this this one's going to Braden. uh congratulations Braden. you're the owner of a brand new galaxy phone <laughs> i just want to go over a few of the things that we've noticed about it again the cameras if you guys research the cameras i'm going to put the details in the description um, maybe some things will flash up here, but maybe the things that you want to know about as YouTubers, we're constantly using GoPro cameras. We're using the uh, 360 cameras. We've always tried to have a little bit of an edge. And most all 
uh, influencers that I'm familiar with easily will say they use their cellular phones uh, or they use a GoPro slash cell phone or maybe just a GoPro. Uh, but these cameras boast a really, really high quality megapixel. In fact, if you look at it, um, I'm going to put the maximum specs here in the uh, the description down below, as well as a link of where you can purchase one if you want to buy them outright. Those will be down below. But outstanding camera. And if you use it on the pro video setting, which I actually have this set on now, uh, you can use an incredibly, incredibly high amount of zoom. Um, read the amount. In fact, I'm going to not try to talk about it. We'll let you read about it further. But read how far. Some people are posting pictures of the moon and things like that. We're going to have to go out and try some of that type of videography at nighttime and see what we can come up with. But anyway, the next thing I do want to talk to you guys about, we'll get them to the phone a little bit further. I'm going to set this to the side. Put that removal tool off to the side. Um, is protection. You're going to end up buying a super, super expensive phone. Um, these phones retail uh, well over $1,000. Um, and so without discussing any kind of price whatsoever, um, if you're upgrading, check out the deal that we got on AT&T. Uh, if you're an AT&T customer, uh, tech, uh, maybe some of the trade-ins that they have available, you would not believe it. Um, we got a really, really awesome deal to AT&T. So now this is actually a, um, a complete case that will protect your device in case of impact. Um, Christy and I and Braden all now will have one. And the one thing I love about this, it actually has a little slide that you can slide over for the camera, as you can see here. See that? You can slide that over and then slide it back to protect your camera. Because I will tell you this right now, you're going to be putting your fingers all over that camera. Okay? And if you drop it, first thing that's going to make contact, camera. So I highly would recommend you get yourself some protective case, protective cover. If you'd like, the link is in the description for this one, which actually included a uh, glass screen protector, which we've used for years. I have actually cracked probably three screen protectors and never had one damaged phone ever out of that by, because the, the glass does its job. It kind of takes the impact uh, beforehand. We'll also say our uh, cell phone cases all, we've dropped our phones a couple times. And on the bottom corner right here, you can actually see the cases were cracked on our own phones, but they did the job uh, to protect the devices. So I would highly recommend spending the money on these. Um, they weren't very expensive. I'll put a link in the description. It actually tells you how to install it, but it's real simple. Clean your phone uh, lens off. It'll give you a cleaning kit for it. Make sure you use the little suave kit that it gives it. Clean it up. Uh, actually, then use the drying cloth and then use the microfiber cloth and then apply it. Make sure there's no dust or debris in the air. Maybe turn the fan off and whatnot, and you'll get a nice good uh, mold and bond to that. So anyway, Christy's got a pink one. Braden's got a blue. I've got a black. That way we can differentiate which is the phone. But we went ahead and went with the same model. Uh, all of us took the black color, kind of silverish color. If you check with your carrier or if you're buying it outright, there is a yellow goldish colored one. Uh, there is kind of like a, oh, kind of a, purplish color you'll see there's a blue uh, and and there's this color now i went with these basic phones because by the time you buy a colored case you can't see the thing anyway right so we just went with the base models and also there was a delay by as much as seven days on several of the different models because it seems like a lot of people like that yellow gold color i kind of will say we've had these phones for quite some time in cases and you can see now i've not wiped this off or cleaned it but I've kept a little plastic on it. They've lasted forever, and the cases did their job to keep them nice and safe. So get yourself good protective case. Uh, link is in the description if you like the ones that we have. I will also say there again, if you want a phone holder, it's built in, so you can actually hold the phone when you do your selfies. Uh, or you can actually prop it up, watch a movie, do face to, uh, do your um, uh, like maybe video chat calls, maybe your uh, messenger or whatnot, video chatting. Uh and also, you can turn this around and uh, lay it up and watch a movie and whatnot. So, really good cover and really good case. All right. And so, again, some of the cool features we've read about on here, the stylus that's built in, once you push the little button, it actually presses and pulls out the, the stylus pin. It is not an actual stylus stylus. It's a pin. Um, when you start writing, you'll see, uh, and I laugh, you click it like a pin, <laughs> 
But as you start holding it, you'll see the light light up on the phone and you can actually start going through um, some of the features like the circle and identification features. Uh, you will have to turn that on, set it up, I did discover, but you can actually go on, circle, and I'll show you here in a minute what I'm talking about. You can actually go on and circle and then actually search Google uh, or your, uh, I said Google search, and it'll let you know what the product was or what the picture was. Maybe you want to order something and you can actually find it very, very expeditiously, but that's built right into it. Makes a noise when you pull it out, and then when you put it back in, it also makes a noise letting you know that you've uh, actually pressed that and put it back in its little spot. So there's the speaker for it right here, right there, and of course the charging port, and of course the microphone, and then the SIM card uh, location. On the side, you do have the power button, the volume up and down button, and then um, you can choose to change this to what you would like it to do. I've got mine customized, but I always will want it to be the power on, power off button. But check it out. That's the way I've got mine set up. Other than that, folks, it is a Samsung Galaxy, newest of the class of phones um, from an outsider looking in. If you're looking to buy one of these and want an honest opinion of it, we've been using it for quite some time now, uh, two days. Battery life, um, I've not had to charge my battery one time. Absolutely incredible battery life, which I'll show you guys again here in a little demonstration in the next uh, segment on the video. But um, the functionality of the phone will be next. Battery life on this thing was insanely good. So um, if you're looking for long-lasting battery life, incredibly good camera and multi-functionality in a Samsung product, this new S24 is it. Every video, uh, YouTube, uh, what do you call it, um, a uh, reviewer, I should say, uh, similar to us, has reviewed these things quite highly. And um, I've even seen a lot of people switching from their Apple product over to them. So leave a comment. Let us know. Do you plan on getting one? Do you have any questions we can answer for you? Um, we've actually set ours up now and uh, become quite familiar with them and absolutely love them. So let us know in the comments and get yourself a Galaxy Ultra 24. All right. And so I have Christy's phone here and I thought I would show you guys this case she got is the pink color. You can see, once again, you can slide that over to cover over the cameras, and that does stay until you actually pop it back open. It kind of clicks. But look at that. covers the camera up. It does come with the glass screen protector. So as you can tell, you can barely see that on there, but I do have a glass cover on it. See? And so that will take up to a fairly decent impact, but it will not damage the screen. Uh, very easy to set up. I'll show you guys a couple cool features on here that we were talking about. For instance, if you go to somewhere like Oh, let's just say you go to, uh, well, let's see, go to Google and let's just go on and just type in, uh, well, since it's the Super Bowl, let's just type in Super Bowl at the time of this video and let's go to, let's see, I'm Christy, so we'll go to images, right? So let's take out our stylus pin, which is down here in the bottom. We'll pull that out. All right. So let's just say that you're going through here and you find an image of say something like, we'll just scroll through here. Okay, let's just, now let's just say you don't know who that is, right? <laughs> so you can actually press this button and hold it for just a second, and it'll ask you to set this up. You must allow this search. So you have to hit continue, and now it'll say search, uh, circle highlight. We did notice that when we first got the phones, we did not have that set up, uh, so we could not do that. Now, once again, I'll also leave this here. See what I'm saying as I'm going over here, how you can actually see the cursor? So let me go ahead and I'm going to back up. Now, see here, it's already said circle anywhere. Can you see that here? So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to circle this as if we don't know who that is. And automatically, you see how it's telling you who that is. Hey, look, it's Travis Kelsey. Why I showed you that was just to show you a really quick representation. Maybe you're trying to figure out somebody. Um, here you go, Allegiant Stadium. Maybe you want to know more about Allegiant Stadium. So once again, uh, you could actually just press that. And then once again, once you've pressed and held the uh, bottom button down in the center, you can actually just go over and draw anywhere. You notice I'm not trying to be correct. I can draw crazy and kind of knows what you want. And that's saying what that is. I thought that was pretty cool, um, in my opinion. It also will let you put it in a different language as well. Yeah, so anyway, um, you notice where it says um, this is not inside now. Make sure it's somewhere safe. It'll actually tell you whether or not your um, product is near. But if you've not turned on air command, 
some of these things don't function properly. So make sure when you're done with the pin and you walk away, you put it back and you'll hear it go in. Take it out. Here it makes a little noise. And again, you can use that as a stylus. So if you've never used a stylus before, it really is neat. And again, anywhere you go, you want to go look on here. You want to press that button and hold it. You want to find out more about, say, anything. Of course, we're probably not going to be able to find out who this dog is. But let's say you want to circle. I bet you'll tell you what kind of a dog it is. Look at that golden retriever. So really neat ideas um, with this new pin. Um, I've actually only had the phone now, as we said, a few days. I'm absolutely enjoying it. Um, again, being able to say maybe like a product like that, you see something and you didn't know where it was. In this case, we see it advertised on the company's website, but maybe you want to know where that is and where did it come from. We'll go ahead and circle that. Let's just see if there's other places that we could uh, in purchase it at. Uh, it does look like you can find it at several places and it kind of be competitive in price as well. Look at that. So you can see the functionality just in a few minutes of just using the stylus and the pen. Really, really awesome um, if you need it for work purposes. Of course, you need the calculator functionality. You can always use it for your calculator functionality and whatnot. But uh, I like this new S Pen. Um, it's not brand new, but it is a new uh, to me. I love this feature. I like using a stylus. I haven't had one in quite some time, so I really look forward to testing it out. So there is a few things I wanted to show you guys because I think it, there's a lot of reviews out there. And if you found our review, we thank you for tuning into our channel. Uh, thank you for watching the video. Uh, but there's a lot of videos out there that are very tech savvy and people going through the phone. It kind of makes you go, huh? Um, I think the things that you bought this phone for, if you're like us, is the battery life. Um, again, I want to show you guys, Christy's had her phone and not charged it once, still at 64%. You know, I thought I'd just go ahead and cut in here and tell you, the reason I bought these phones really was because there's a really incredible deal with AT&T and we needed to upgrade our product. And we really have to say at the time of this video that we were really blown away by the battery life on the phones. I can get it every bit of two days uh, on mine, even with good usage. Um, if you decide to use it for the battery, uh, you're going to love it. If you decide to use it for the camera, you're going to find that as influencers, a lot of us use GoPro cameras and the 360 cameras. But you'll find like the old DSLR cameras, you can get up even up to the RAW as you see me doing right here now, which you will have to download RAW from the uh, App Store free of charge. But you can actually do the original RAW and JPEG images and develop some of the most amazing quality photos you've ever seen in your life. In fact, I hadn't showed it on here, but with a telephoto lens that I did discover later, you can get into the trend of taking photos with the, uh, of the moon and, and things that are far away. Just play with it. You're going to have to learn what ISO is and you're going to learn what white balance is and whatnot. But by the time you're done you're definitely going to, going to use those pro modes on there and have some really really awesome videos uh, that you can be really proud of so again i just want to tell you two thumbs up from christy and i on the phones and from baby girl i have to give you a two paws up on hers uh, great phone uh, the battery life is insanely good the camera quality is insanely amazing i might just do some videos of just the uh well, in fact, I'll tell you what, from now on, most all the videos you're going to see are going to come from this phone, uh, unless specified otherwise. So you'll see what I'm talking about yourself in the quality. Leave a comment. Let us know. Uh, have you already upgraded the phone? Do you have any questions that we can answer? Uh, at the time of this video, we have gone through quite a lot, and I can pretty much answer just about anything that you may have. Uh, within reason. <laughs> uh, if I can help you with anything, let me know. But leave a comment. Let us know. Did this help you to decide to get you a new Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra? Are you guys going to hold off? Uh, what is your thoughts? Uh, for your Apple users out there that are switching over, I will tell you now again, I, I don't really care for the Apples. I know a lot of folks do, uh, but you're going to find that this has an amazing camera compared to what you're used to. So thanks for watching this video and all of our videos right here that we review you. My suggestion is you watch this video coming up, but you too think you should watch this one coming up next, right here on We Review You. Take care, everybody.